So I'm going to say Just use these x values. Where A is a vertical stretch factor. That's essentially what I did here. Okay? Like this would be like for x equals 2, right? But if we divide 2 by a, which is 0.02, we get 100, right? So I can say here that <laughs> 2 over a would be 2 over 0.02, which is 100, right? And here, that would be like your negative 1 over A is negative 1 over 0.02 is negative 50. That'll put you on a reasonable scale for both X and Y. Okay? And that's what actually happened here. So another example, and I'll do this for a big vertical stretch. I did it for a small vertical stretch, right? So let's say you had I'm going to use y equals 50 times x minus 90 squared plus plus 70. Okay? So what I'm going to say here is this is a big Big vertical stretch, A equals 50. If you take just your standard Y equals X squared graph and multiply all the numbers by 50, between here and here, 50 times this distance is going to be off the board, right? So it's just going to be very sharp. You're not going to see much. Okay? So we just do 2 over a, negative 2 over a, negative 1 over a, and so forth, right? Then we'll get a table. I don't have room to draw everything in the board, but I can draw the table. So what we have first, we have our graph. Okay? Now we can think negative 2, negative 1, negative 1, half, 1, half, 1, 2, and we can think 4. Right? We're not going to think of it, don't write it down. Okay? And we plot our points. There's 4, there would be 2, there would be 1, there would be 1 half, there would be 1, 4. So we have points here, 
here, here, and here, and here, 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 and here. So here is our graph. Okay. Now let's see what happens with our table. Well, our table is going to be negative 0.04, negative 0.010, 0 0.01. Point oh four. Now we want to do y equals a x squared, and that would be fifty x squared, right? Okay. I'm going to change my 90 and my 70 because I was thinking backwards on that. Okay. Okay, so anyhow, 0.04 times 50 is 2, and 0.04 times that is 0.08. This will be, should be one fourth of that, should be 0.02. But it isn't, so maybe I did my arithmetic wrong. 50 times 10 thousandths is 0 0.005. 50 times that, 8. Okay, I'm going to turn the camera off because this is getting embarrassing. <laughs>